if the answer wasn't just heads or tails, but both at the same time. In classical computing, bits are like coins lying flat. They're either heads, one, or tails, zero. Simple, predictable, binary. But a quantum bit, a qubit, is more like a coin spinning in the air. While it spins, it's not just heads or tails, it's a mix of both. That is superposition. The qubit holds multiple possibilities at once. But here's the twist. The moment you measure that qubit, it stops spinning. The possibilities collapse and you get a definite result, heads or tails. This is where quantum gets weird and powerful. By working with spinning coins, not just fixed outcomes, quantum computers explore many potential answers simultaneously. And with the right algorithms, they guide the spin towards the most useful result. It's not magic, it's math and physics at a whole new level. And it's already opening doors to material science, logistics, and finance.